I love Toronto because it is the best city in the world. You have such a diversity of cultures, of backgrounds, of people, of interests. The thing about Toronto that appeals to me most is the fact that there's a real edge, there's a real energy. Whether it be music or dance or arts or festivals all summer long. You can never get bored in this city. It's basically one big playground. People are health conscious in this city. You can go to yoga, you can ride your bike, you can run, you can go to the outdoor swimming pools. It's fantastic. There's so much to do here. I love Toronto because it has so many great restaurants. The multicultural nature of Toronto, you know, is quite difficult on a boy's waistline because I like to eat. There's a gastronomic flair in this city. There are several Chinatowns. There's Portuguese town, Italian town. Ethiopian food one night, and then you're gonna go have Italian the next night, and Thai food the next night. Each of these little areas of the city is just another opportunity to travel the world without leaving Toronto. On the weekends, I love going to the farmer's market. There really is a focus on slow food, and there really is a focus on bringing people back to the farmer's market. There is just such a wealth of people that are really passionate about eating, growing, cooking, and enjoying fresh, delicious local food. I love going to Kensington Market because there's hole-in-the-wall restaurants and also a lot of veg-focused restaurants, vegan-focused restaurants, and just the people watching is great. There's a lot of free events that happen in public spaces, planting trees in the springtime to doing yoga outdoors in the park in the summer. I think my favorite thing to do in Toronto is to enjoy the outdoors. Magic Hour in Trinity Bellwoods Park. There are little pods of people having picnics, playing guitars, and it's just, it's a beautiful time of day. If I had an extra hour to myself, I would definitely go over to Toronto's island and just chill out on the beach. The Wards Island is just beautiful. You can go rent a canoe, and then you can canoe around the island, and not a lot of people know that you can do that. It's great. When you look out to the lush, verdant greenery of Toronto Island, it settles your soul. It doesn't even feel like you're in the city, it's totally unique. The people of Toronto inspire me. I feel like I'm living in a far more integrated place than I've ever lived in before. Different religions, different practices, and I feel like I can express myself in a really open and very honest way. It's an easy place to find a community. And I think that's crucial, is that you need to build a web of community around you, and I was worried about that in a big city, but when you find your niche, you can really cultivate a community around it. To be able to work and play in the same spot, it really brings a different dynamic to how the city is, and it, it doesn't seem so big anymore. There are a lot of pockets in the city that are undiscovered. You find these little neighborhoods inside the big city, and there's this whole life of its own. There's so many amazing places to visit in the city. I love Toronto. Every single night when I look at the CN Tower, I'm just, I can't even believe that I live here. This city is a party, and by God, we love to party.